Hi, I'm Ed Wise from SP Men's Soccer. Well, Ed, the uh, team got uh, one game under your belt and part of another one. Interesting opening week here at Interbase Stadium. Uh, your thoughts on the first week of action? Um, I felt that our first game went well. I think near like the second half we were put under a bit of pressure. Our mentality changed a bit, but you know, lots of things to work on. It was more, I think, we came out well. We got a goal in the second half. I think our first half was better, but you know, lots of things that we can build on. And, and let's then, talk about that goal. Uh, Mario Vukic gets it a very yeah. nice goal. What do you remember about it? I remember, for sure, Alden played him through. He won the ball. We said we were on a transition. It was sort of a counter. Alden slips him through, and he takes a touch, and then keeper comes out, just gets the ball over him. And then I, from where I was standing, it looked almost like it was going to go out. But after watching film, it was dead center. He yeah. couldn't have missed. So it was a great goal, great finish. Perfect. So. And then, unfortunately, they uh, get a late goal to equalize and you end up yeah. uh, after two overtimes a draw. Then you come out very well again in Chico State on Saturday yeah. in an interesting game. Uh, Early goal by you on a set yeah. piece. Describe what happened on that. Um, well, so typically our runs have been a lot of the same. I've kind of sat in the same spot, and we were talking before the game, you know, maybe change it up, switch our runs up a bit. And I, it was, I walked up, and he was like, oh, do you want to go to near post this time? I was like, yeah, sure. And then ball came in. I saw it. It was a good cross by Titus. Ball came in, just kind of jumped into it and flicked it, and it managed to go in. So. Uh, okay. Very, very nice header, great placement. Is that at the point where you have a chance to pick a spot, or are you just trying to put it on frame? Um, I think there, I saw where the keeper was, and I saw there was a guy somewhat near post. So I was like, okay, it's coming hard at me. If I get it across, the keeper's not going to have any time to react. So I think it was more in the corner than I could have hoped for, and it was a better header than I would have originally expected. So. So that's the good news. You scored a goal. The bad news is uh, that goal technically gets wiped off the board uh, due to events beyond your control. Uh, I had some unusual weather in Seattle, and uh, late in the um, first half, we had lightning had to clear the field. Um, what uh, what did the team do during that near two hour uh, wait? Um, well, for the first like thirty minutes, we all kind of sat there talking about what we could do. We were a bit like excited because we thought we were playing well, um, and then. And then Mark walked in and started talking to us a bit. And he's like, oh, by the way, it just reset. So he talked like another 20 minutes. And we're like, okay, maybe like 10 minutes left. We'll see what happens. And then we kind of just like were relaxing. Took our shin pads and cleats off. And like, walked outside and it was just lightning every yeah. three seconds or so. So like I really like thunderstorms and lightning, but <laughs> probably in the worst possible timing, especially since I scored as well. So. It sure was. And uh, we had to clear the clear the stands and wait. A real... Kind of a Midwest-like uh, thunderstorm, yeah, thunder no. lightning storm. We don't get those often. Yeah, no, so well, eventually uh, it persisted, and we're able to not able to get the game in. So had to cancel, and it goes in. There's yeah. no contest. None of the stats count, including yeah. your goal, unfortunately. Except for <laughs> so uh, yes, exactly. Uh, so then uh, now the team is has a draw on the record, and that's it. Mm -hmm. Going to the Midwest on the first road trip. Uh, yeah. Thoughts on playing Colorado Mines and West Texas a and a couple of very good teams on yeah. the road. We've heard good things about them. Like we know that they were, I think they were both in the finals for their region last year, or they they did well last year. So it's going to be a couple of hard games, and we want to go to them and you know show what we've got and take the game to them and see you know. Bring Seattle to them, see what happens. I think it'll be a good game, but I think we're ready and we've got another couple of days of training. So Great. Well, let's go back a little bit to even before preseason. You had a unique opportunity to go to Europe and yeah. play some games and, and travel around a little bit. Uh, mm -hmm. Tell us about that trip just a bit. Um, well, we started in Sittard, which is like a small kind of town area. Like it was really nice and homely. Like we were in a like a stadium, athletic like stadium for uh, and a hotel that connected. And then we like would walk into the town every night, and it was just kind of fun to walk around with our friends, you know, experience all the different culture. Um, we got to tour Ajax Stadium and Munster and Gladbach Stadium, which is really cool as well. Like we got a full tour, got to see the like all the um, changing rooms, and like the field was fantastic. They had all like the lights and like different like it was like fake sun to keep the grass nice, so <laughs> that was cool. And then um, we got to go to Paris for a day, which was really fun. And then these are like, I'm just saying stuff that we did yeah. that wasn't playing soccer. And like, it wasn't the reason why we were there, you know, soccer, like even for the soccer was fun. I think our first game wasn't the best, but we kind of bounced back. We played better. Um, it was just a great experience overall. We got, to, we got really close with each other as well. It was a good way to start the season. So. Sure did. Um, well, now you uh, play in the back line as central defender. You're back there. Um, three of the four of you are back there, returned from last year. Uh, yeah. Travis Swallows joined you on yeah. the uh, left side. Uh, how do you feel now that you have an extra, a year of experience, college experience, and that group has been together here? How do you think that'll uh, help out this year? Um, I think it'll be good. I think even just from watching our first game against Sonoma, I know the stats showed they had like 
like 27 shots to uh, you know less, but you know they scored once, so I think we were tighter in the back. And it feels like our communication last year, we were just like I guess we we're getting to know each other a bit lax. But now I think I can say things, and it's like he already knows what I'm gonna say because he knows like you know even though I'm like I'm gonna start saying something, it's like oh got it, and it's almost like we're on the same page more. So that's good. I and mean, like we're doing it for each other, and now we're even closer. So it's more of like a you know, come on, like do it for each other kind of thing. So wonderful. Well, Ed, thank you so much for your time. We yeah, appreciate thanks. it. Uh, congratulations on a good start to odd yeah. start, and good luck on the road trip. Thank you.